All right, what's going on, guys? We're back uh, in Easy's kitchen here. A little cooking vlog again. And then today's video, we got this beautiful top sirloin steak for you all. And um, I'm gonna show you all how to cook a steak. I don't know if I'm gonna show you, but uh, I'm gonna explain how I like to cook my steak. Let's see, how much is this? This is, oh, I gotta cancel. 10 ounces, but that's uncooked, so it's probably like 5 ounces. Um, it's a half pound, so I'm going to show you all how to cook a steak bodybuilder style, whatever that means. Alright, so the first thing I'm doing is uh, just heating the pan up, getting it nice and warm. Yeah, just getting it nice and warm there. It's maybe a little too much heat. Maybe like medium. Medium's usually good. Medium. Now, personally, I like to use... A little bit of oil. As I well, that's kind of hot, but this is spray on. Um, I don't like to like when I say bodybuilder style. Like what I mean, what I mean is in an off-season setting, like I am right now. I don't want to have to worry about you know, like when you're bulking. The last thing you care about is. I mean, flavor is nice, but. I think when you're just trying to get your meals in and like uh, you just get tired of eating and you just want to down these things, you know, you don't you stop caring so much about flavor. So that's what I mean bodybuilder style. Uh, there's not going to be, you can season it, but I'm not going to season it. I'm sure I'm just going to slap that thing on there, a little bit of oil. And uh, yeah. Alrighty, there we go. We got the steak on the grill, or on the stick, or on the pan. <laughs> Whatever. We slap that thing on there. Um, so I'll usually, this is a thicker one, so I might be like three, three and a half minutes per side. Um, actually, trying to pinch it a little bit. Three minutes, three and a half minutes, maybe four. Um, honestly, like when it comes to cooking steaks, it comes down to experience and just kind of understanding what you're cooking. Um, there's no perfect way to do it, just don't ever eat a steak raw. Uh, and uh, it'll be good, you know. You can always overcook, you can't undercook now. So, I'll get back to you guys in about six minutes or so, seven minutes when this is done, and uh, get my carbohydrates ready. I actually, my veggies, um, and yeah, that's how I like to cook a steak. So, okay, guys, so real quick, can't really see it here, but like, see how right there it's turned a little bit brown in the middle. That's how you know it's kind of like a good time to turn it over for medium rare. So I'm going to flip this real quick. There we have it. We flipped it. <clears throat> and there we go right there. Kind of see that pinkish on the bottom and then obviously the uh, very brown right there. But overall, like, and then I'll do like 30 minutes on this side. And then, man, that's not me. I'll do like cooking. <laughs> um, so yeah, like... That's kind of how I do it, and then I'll probably leave that maybe like two minutes, three, like that thing's cooking real good. So, I'll do that, and then um, uh, I'll turn it off and leave it sit for like five minutes. So, that's kind of how I like to cook a steak, and uh, you guys do not get to see me eat this, because I'm going to enjoy this in peace. So, um, hopefully next week, I can, next weekend, or next sometime next in the next two weeks, I can maybe get another training video out. Um, my boy Caleb's competing this weekend, so maybe we'll go to that and vlog with him some, watch him hit some powerlifting records. So, next weekend, not this weekend, next weekend, uh, next Sunday. So, that should be fun. And once he's done, like, we'll be rolling out some lifting videos again. So, I think that'll be fun. It'll be worth my time. Maybe not uploading every day, maybe every two days, so... I'm going to enjoy an up on loading every day though, so anyways guys, catch you in the next video.